Welcome to Chronicles of Comfort. Our reading of comfort is taken from Ephesians 2.18. For through him we both have access by one spirit to the Father. Have you ever been targeted by scammers? Oh yes, there are many scam alerts that are going out. Many scammers try to catch us off guard as they try to get access to our private information. Right now, scammers are going around trying to get your security code on WhatsApp. They will call you to pretend to be part of a group you are or something you belong to. They will then send something to your phone and they'll want you to read out that number to them. Once you read out that number to them, you are in trouble because when they get it, they lock you out and try to get money from individuals who believe it is actually you who is requesting it. In addition to this, there are other scams going around. Some try to get into your bank account, your email, your Facebook page, your home security system, or anywhere they think they can benefit. That is why we must establish security measures to protect us from those who want to rob us or to cause us harm. We need to ensure that they receive no access. But there's an access of a different kind. While scammers try to impersonate you to take what you and your family and friends may possess, on the other hand, Christ wants access to us so he can grace us with all his blessings in this life and the life to come. Ephesians 2.18 also reminds us that if we give him access, we also have access to the Father. You see, Christ does not want to take. He wants to add to our resources. We get better by giving him full access. And the sooner, the better it is for us. He is honest. He will not force or even try to trick us. Free will is what's needed. At this time of the year, many are wondering what gift they can give to others. Today, why don't you give the Lord your heart? Give Him full access to your life. There are so many things He wants to bless you with. He sees your struggles and He really wants to improve your life today. Please grant him that full access. This will be the best security measure you will ever make in your life. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we give full access to you right now. Please infuse your spirit within us. We pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for being with me today. And as always, may the Chronicles of the Bible provide comfort and salvation to you.